Hi everyone, Nathan from JS Power Sports. We've got about 15 minutes of a heat cycle on this machine. We've let it cool all the way down, and now we are going to retorque the head, the cylinder bolts, the power valve, and the exhaust manifold. Because once they heat up, it smashes that gasket in between, and when it cools back down and condenses, um, it, it can leave a crack on that gasket, which can then leak water or whatever. And these are supposed to be set at 28 Newton meters, which is uh, 20.65 foot-pounds and as I put this on here these all have lines drawn from the factory straight across and you're gonna watch this little turn that one just went a little bit is all That one went quite a bit. See, this is why it's important to do these, especially on the exhaust manifold. I know they're hard to get to, and you may have to actually pull the tail cone pipe off, gas tank and water box tail cone pipe off to be able to get back into them. I'm gonna pull these air cleaners here in a second, and be careful not to drop anything down there, put a towel across it, and then I'll um, make sure that all those are tightened up, uh, retorqued as well. And that's it for this. Uh, I'll show you how to get to our tech support page on our website. Okay, when you get on our website, just click on the orange watercraft, whether the button's right here in the middle or if it's up here at the top, just click on the watercraft. Click on crash, and then there it is right there, tech support. Click on tech support, and you'll find all the owner's manuals, the uh, crash known issues and fixes, along with a whole bunch of other stuff, including the microfishes in here, um, your carb settings, elevation uh, as well for... Uh, Impeller changes too, and then you'll find torque settings and all kinds of other stuff. Hit like, hit subscribe, we'll bring you some more. Thank you.